Hello and welcome. Today we're gonna rotate videos in Olive. Let me just import these videos in here. And there's many different ways you might want to rotate a video. Let's start with a normal video. Gonna drag it to the timeline. And if you want to just rotate it a little bit, you can click on it and then use the rotation transform to rotate it a little bit. This creates black edges, corners. You can fix this by scaling in. All right, I'm gonna delete this and put it into the timeline again. A different thing you might want to do with rotation is keyframing it. So we're gonna enable the keyframes. And let's just assume we want to start with this rotation, so no rotation. We're gonna move a little in the timeline. Let's go to about five seconds. And now we're gonna rotate it. Here we go. So if we play this back, we can see it moving over time. And we're gonna scale. Let's first go beyond the second keyframe and let's scale in to conceal the rotation. And this is how it looks in the end result. Alright, so let's forget about this kind of rotation and now let's figure out how do we handle this kind of video. One that has been recorded on the side somehow. So what you're gonna do is just right click the clip in the project and press properties. Over here we can see the resolution 720 by 1280 and also the frame rate. Let's just right click it again and go to new sequence. The default preset appears to be 1080p, which is convenient because that's exactly what we want to rotate it to. Or rather we want 720p. So let's set that. Press OK. Drag in the clip. And now we can go to effects over here and simply rotate by 90 degrees. In this case to the negative. So we can just click here and type in 90 with a minus in front of it. And there we go, this clip has been rotated. To correct it, now we just need to go to File and Export and set this to, I suppose, 22 and hit Export and give it a file name. And now finally we have this kind of clip which should be vertical but is horizontal. So let's fix this one, we're gonna right click it again, go to Properties, confirm the resolution, this is 1280 by 720. Frame rate is 23.976. Let's right click it again, go to new sequence and we're going to set this to 720p again, but we're going to switch the 720 and 1280. So 720 in the width and 1280 in the height. And we're going to also adjust the frame rate. 23.976 was it, wasn't it? And let's press OK. Drag in the clip. And now, of course, we're going to just again rotate it again into the negative this time. Depending on your situation, you might have to rotate it to 90. And there it is, it's fixed. All we gotta do is export it. Check out my other tutorials for all of Video Editor. Feel free to ask any video editing questions in the comments and subscribe to always see the newest tutorial. Until next time, ciao.